Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. It is D and for thank you for the comments and for the likes and thank you for subscribing. So if you don't know what this video is about, please stay tuned. Hi guys, so today I'm going to be talking about understanding your relationship with God or building up a relationship with God. And I'm going to be talking about it. And I'm going to be talking about four things. That you can consider or you should consider in building up a relationship with God now the first thing is allow God to align you now everybody everyone carries different grace everyone has different grace upon your life so allow God in let God into your life and let him align you let him define the boundaries and the limitations and um, understand God talk to God and you know learn how or rather try and build yourself to know when God is speaking the spirit of discernment and that will really help you when God aligns you it, it is really great because you do things according to what the Word of God says and not what the world says and, and that, is, that is just perfect now that's the first thing secondly um, we should always have something that constantly drives us to yearn for God. Um, just I, I go to the Redeemed Christian Church of God, and you know, you, you can become a worker in church, and you can teach, you can go to a clean church, you can join the Salvation Army, you can join different types of groups in church. You cannot be, you can, it might not even be joining a group in church. It might be going out to preach to people. It can be helping the needy, going to the orphanage, or anything. That one thing that just keeps you working for God, that thing that constantly drives you. It can even be your music playlist. When you listen to your gospel playlist, you're like, you know, God, I just love you. I just want to serve you continuously. So that thing, you know, that just gingers it over the time to be with God and be in God's presence. You should have that. That is number two. Now, number three. Um, be mindful of your weaknesses and your strengths or rather know your strengths and your weaknesses Know what takes you back backwards and know what um, has a tendency to make you backslide I think every Christian or every normal human being should know their strength and your weaknesses You know when you can fall short and once you identify Whatever your weaknesses, whether you just have this particular friend that keeps you know giving you all these stories or anything, and then you're like, Man, this person is living the life, let me just follow this person, or maybe it's it can be anything that just draws you down or can make you weak in spirit. Once you identify that, pray to God and let it go because you don't want to go five steps forward in your spiritual life or in your Christian life and then go ten steps backwards. It's you don't want to backslide a Christian and I pray that God will help us and we will not backslide in Jesus name now lastly just to say this out everyone has a different grace everyone when I say different grace everyone has spiritual capabilities different spiritual capabilities and you know our talents are different our gifts are different so know what your gift is know what your purpose is because you cannot say for example if you don't if you haven't gotten the spirit of uh, the gift of speaking in tongues and then probably you go to church and then you hear someone speak, and you try to force yourself to speak in tongues or you don't know how to sing and you want to force yourself to sing when well, you know oh, that my friend she can reach she is blessed with the voice don't do what another don't say oh because the person is doing it that means i can do it now let god say you know what Dilly, this is your gift. This is what I have given unto you to, you know, win souls for me or to serve me. And th this is your purpose. This is what I've called you to do. And if it's your time to speak in tongues, you would speak in tongues. Don't worry. Don't fuss it. Every everything will come as long as you desire it. So you know, everybody's grace is different. Everybody's spiritual capabilities is different. And you know, you should you should understand that in building your relationship with God. God has different, amazing, and beautiful gifts for you. All you need to do is just to pray and keep believing that God is going to reveal that which He has proposed for me. So thank you guys so much for watching and I hope that you have um, enjoyed this video and learned a few things. Just a recap or a summary. Today we're talking about understanding or building a relationship with God. And the first thing I talked about was aligning with Christ. And the second thing I talked about was having something that constantly drives you to serve God. And the third thing I talked about is... What was the third thing I talked about? <laughs> The third thing I talked about is identifying your strength and your weaknesses as a Christian. And the fourth thing is, who can tell me what it is? Yes, you, you reason up your hand. 
Oh yeah. And then the fourth thing is identifying your spiritual capabilities. Ask God to reveal unto you your spiritual capabilities, your gifts. And you know, if you have any desire, you tell God that, oh God, I love I would love to speak in tongues, I would love to grow higher in spirit, I would love to, you know, anything you want to talk to God about, just meet him and he's got you. He's gonna do he's gonna do mighty things. So, you know, believe in God and keep having faith and he will surprise you. Don't forget, bespoke miracles, tailored intervention, custom made miracles just for you and for me. Okay, so guys, I have a song for the day. I, I'm into Long songs. I love songs a lot. So my song of the day is Sonny Badu S O N N I E space B A D U and it is my soul says yes. It's a, it's a beautiful song. It has really blessed my life and changed my life. And you guys can download it anywhere. And trust me, you would fall in love with this song. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. See you guys in the next video.